So if you like fishing, or even if you like scuba diving, you've got to be a little bit more on the advanced side for the scuba diving back here because Hi. with the big Hi, seal and sea lion oh, yeah. population, you get a greater it's just, it's number of great white sharks out here on this side. But I mean, it's the Pacific Ocean, that's where sharks live, so you've got to expect that. A lot of yellow tail back here. Lots of sea bass. We get black and white sea bass. We got a white sea bass hatchery at Two Arbors. A lot of calico. sunset is tonight, like 8 o'clock maybe, and you can see the sunset back here. It's only about a mile from here down to the Botanical Garden, so it wouldn't take too long to get up here, and it's a really easy trip too. I mean, it's not like the trail that we've been on. It's not nearly that rugged. And you could do it on a mountain bike too if you wanted to. Yeah, they don't let um, any of the fun stuff out here. So I'm very lucky that I have the job that I do. And they don't let quads or ATVs or motorcycles or anything like that out here. The only things that can go outside the city are hikers and bicyclists. And if you had a moped, you have to be able to operate it with the pedals, but you can bring little yeah, mopeds out here. Like, oh, <laughs> get a little closer to the edge for you there. Definitely. Oh. <laughs> this is the route that the Grand Fondo Mountain Bike Race takes. Actually, don't go around this entire tour. for the foxes. Like I said, Catalina foxes are, are uh, they're really small and they're great. 